Now, let us do a comparison to understand the difference between conventional LASIK and trans-epi LASIK. LASIK, also known as the flap and zap method, requires the surgeon to cut across your cornea to create a flap with either a laser or a blade. The flap is then lifted up and laser is applied to reshape your cornea, correcting your vision. After laser is applied, the flap is then repositioned back to its original place. Next, let us talk about how trans-epi-lasic is done. Trans-epi-lasic, a one-step all-laser procedure, does not involve any cutting on your cornea, thus eliminating any flap creation on your eyes. In trans-epi-lasic, the surface epithelium layer is vaporized accurately using excimer laser. Once the Bowman membrane is exposed, the same excimer laser is then applied to shape your cornea, correcting your vision. After your vision is corrected, a permeable, high oxygen content bandage lens will be placed on your eye to protect your eyes while the epithelium layer regenerates. It will take about three to five days for the layer to regenerate. In comparison with epilasic, there is no creation of flap, thus eliminating the risk of flap-related complications.